I got what? All right, so we are back and we are playing um, Hyra Baby. Um, it's been a little while again since I've played it. I don't know why I do this to myself, why I like get back into something and then I don't play it for a while and then I forget what I'm doing. So I got to look up the instructions or the rules again. So give me a second. God, their music is too loud. Um. All right. So while they're sleeping, I, th I just was gonna look at aging. Uh, Cause I think aging is different for this challenge, and I just really can't remember. Oh, it just says ninety days. Ninety days. All right, we will put it on ninety days. That's fine. That I can do. Um, okay. Well, let me put my aging down to 90 days real quick. And while I do that, I'm going to turn down my kids' music. It's really loud. Um, so let's see if I put it here three seven this is like 27 I think 27 10 um, that means that uh, some of these gotta go down I think this is like two and four. Hmm. Maybe this was seven. That might be, that might be it actually. Um. I don't really want babies for four days. Two days is plenty for babies. Let's do an extra day for uh, extra two days, I guess, for toddlers. So two, six, seven, fourteen, twenty-seven, twenty-seven, seven. Honestly, this should be zero, like as low as possible, because I'm not even gonna play with elders. So, yeah, that's just unfortunate. Okay, let me turn this down. She's pretty loud. There we go. Okay. Now, pull back up my Twitch. Here we go. And if anyone said anything, I missed it. So feel free to say it again. All right. So we've got all that done. Everyone is asleep because it is 2.44 in the morning. In the last episode, we did have Catherine and Daphne move out. Um, so that's all good in the hood and everyone else is fast asleep. We have $48,074. So we're going to be doing quite a bit of a big renovation today and I am here for it. <laughs> I'm so excited. Um, so yeah, we'll be, we'll be building onto our lot today, which is going to be fantastic and going from there. Everyone is, like, stuck. Um, okay, so let's look at how long everyone has. So this is Jasmine. Oh, wow. Eli just finished his xylophone. Holy moly. All right, Eli. Are you done with the peg box, buddy? Go ahead and stop playing that. And does he have books in his inventory? 
Or has he read all the books? Play it. She's not in your way. Oh my goodness. Is he serious? Okay, let's try and move this over then. <sighs> Alright, let's put it like... Let's put it right there. And see if he can play with it there. Play? Yes? How'd you come read this book? He really needs to go potty. Let's have him do that first. Hi, Shadwell. Welcome. It is evening here. It's 2.17 in the morning there. Oh, it's not that early. It's 9.18 here. <laughs> Alright, who has all the rest of these books? Is it mom? Yeah, mom's got them, I think. Where's the rest of the green ones? I only see three in her, or six in her inventory. Alright, let's have Eli read this. Where's the rest of the green ones? Oh, they're in her inventory. I wonder if he is, if Eli has read them. Alright, so we're just waiting on everyone to wake up. We're going to have to take Eli over to the bookstore, or not the bookstore, the library today and get him um, finished on all of his skills. What else does he need to learn? He knows how to potty. He needs to learn how to talk and to walk. Oh, boy. And how long does she have? She has quite a bit of days. So we really just need to focus on Eli right now and get him, get him through the rest of all of his stuff. But while everyone's sleeping, it's a good thing for him to finish this all up. So, we'll go from there. Okay, she wants to teach Frederick to walk and Eli. That is going to be fantastic. We are going to go ahead and do that. Um, I am going to let her go ahead and use the bathroom because that is what she needs to do. So, we'll go ahead and use and take a shower. And then um, we'll have her go ahead and eat some of the birthday cake that's in there. Since we're not supposed to feed it to our children... We should probably eat it ourselves, and unless did she make the cake i think she might have so technically they could eat it which would be fantastic all right she just pooped her pants so i'm gonna have you get up and i am gonna have you change the dirty diaper and then maybe feed her Eat the cake. <laughs> yeah. This house really needs to get cleaned. It is disgusting. Look at that sink. It's so gross. It's so gross. <laughs> All right, Georgia. Oh, I forgot we added this. I really like that addition. All right, we're going to have you go ahead and put Ginger in the high chair. 
Don't put her in the crib. Put her in the high chair. He wants the garden. What are you doing? Hold her. She's hungry. Why would you put her in the crib? All right, never mind. What about Eli? What does he need? He just needs social, really. All right. All right, Mom, come on over here and snuggle him. Can you just leave her alone? You've already put her in there now. We're not going to grab her back out now. She's sleeping. Use, shower, and we'll have you eat some of the cake as well. And you are going to have a quick meal of some plasma orange juice. And then we'll have you use the bathroom. But before you do that, let's go ahead and clean this up. Because that's pretty disgusting. What have you been up to lately, Shadwell? Answer the phone. You're going to breastfeed him? Okay. I'll consider that her food. The drum line. Drum for the military at Fort Salas Military Base at the appropriate hour. Sure. <laughs> Alright, go ahead and clean that up as well. And then go ahead and take a shower. Alright, so Frederick is great. He does need to go potty. So let's have mom go ahead and potty train him. Eli. Okay. Alright, she wants to get to level six of the guitar skill. So we'll have her play alone. And what is what else does he need? Nothing. He doesn't need anything else. Okay, he's gonna go ahead and play with his iPhone. Mom is gonna go ahead and pick up Eli. She's gonna snuggle him. And we're actually gonna lay Eli down for a little bit before we go to the library. We're going to um We're going to let him get some sleep because he's really tired. So go ahead and put him in the crib and then you can empty out the potty. And then she can clean this, mop up the puddle, clean this. Um... Yeah, so far I think that looks okay. Not a lot. Been having a lot of car trouble this year due to its age. Then nearly everything needs replacing. So spent a bomb even though wasn't prepared for massive bills like these and still not finished. Is something wrong and display is useless. I want the fault malfunction is. Mm. 
I hear you on car troubles. All right, what are you doing? What are you doing? You may hold her, but don't feed her in the high chair unless I tell you to feed, what to feed her because I don't want you to mess up. So go ahead and we'll put her in the high chair. Well, I hope it gets better. I think good. Uh, just pretty much busy with the kiddos. And working on my YouTube and Twitch. That's really all I've been doing. Okay, go ahead and serve her up the stew surprise. I am going to go ahead and let mom, um, what does Frederick need? Nothing. Okay. She needs to go back to bed after she eats. So I'm going to let mom for right now go ahead and teach him to talk. Why did you take her out? Go teach him to talk. No, please give it to her. Ah, now I can't give it to her. All right, serve her Sue surprise. Why do you have to even mush that? It's like literally mush already. Makes no sense to me. He doesn't work today? Oh, okay. Alright. Just sit here. Who's crying? Is it him? No. Oh, it's her. <laughs> no, just wait. Man, he really does just not want to just wait. Alright, come pick her up. <laughs> and then put her in the crib. You're building a model truck? That's cool. You gotta get it painted. Go drum. Okay. Um, do we have any mail? We can pay the bills and get the mail. Oh, yeah.
use. Is it spring? No, it's 12 more days until spring. They're gla like the size of glasses screws. <laughs> Sounds like all the kids' toys nowadays. All right, he's having a bunch of fun watching TV. Eli is awake, so I'm going to have mom go ahead and stop. And I am just going to let her potty train Fred Frederick. Oh my goodness, that's too much. All right, we got 210 and then another 2027. So that's really good. Did you have to buy it in pieces? And like, have you bought everything to build it so far? Like everything you need? Alrighty. All right, we're gonna let him play with this again, and we're gonna have mom come pick up um, Eli. She can go ahead and change his diaper. Dang. All right, let's have her put Eli in the high chair. Please don't do that. You horrible mother. All right, um, go ahead and use. Does she have all the books now? One, two, three, four, five. He read, Eli read those two. So let's just give these to mom real quick. And I am going to have him go to the bathroom.
the body panels were the most expensive? Why is it so expensive? Is it made out of pure gold? All right, let's have mom eat and then we're gonna have her take him to the library. So eat some of the cake. Where is mom? Let's have her come pick Eli up. And use. And get some plasma juice. And then you can play the guitar. Actually, let's finish the painting. And then you can do the guitar. I wish, but that would probably cost over a hundred thousand. <laughs> I wouldn't go for less than 21 karat gold. <laughs> oh my gosh. Are you like building it to sell it or something? Or are you like collect them? All right, let's go to the library with Eli. Ah, uh, gotcha. Alright, we'll catch up with them in a second. No, you're not going to bed. You're going to go ahead and get some leftovers. You're going to have some birthday cake. And then you're going to do the jelly bean challenge. So, you have to eat three magic jelly beans in hopes that you don't die. And we'll ju I'll pause because I don't want to miss it. But, um... Georgia is going to be at the library, so if anything happens, unfortunately, she's going to miss it tonight. I want her to read it inside. There we go. Read with Eli. Read with Eli. Read with Eli. Read with Eli. And then these two. Read with Eli. Read with Eli. I'm going to stay locked on her, but I'm going to be watching him. There's one yellow. Mm. Okay. Oh no, someone just died at the library. That's horrible. <laughs> All right, Jack. Got one more, buddy. There you go. Jack is good. He can go to bed. Oh. Oh, the Grim Reapers thing scared the bejesus out of me. Who is it? Aw, oh, Contest Shelly Lazen. I feel bad for her. 
Alright, so it's this book, this book, this book. This book. Oh wait, she still got some in her inventory. I think it might be just that one we have to reread again. Um, why doesn't he have a shirt on? Okay. Alright, Eli. You're finally getting there. Alright, she needs to get out of her bed and go potty. Alright, let's have you uh, let Ginger out. And then I'm gonna have you put Frederick in the high chair. All right, what does she need? The potty and to eat. All right, let's have you serve him food. Um, give him baby food. Oh, not you. Serve him up food. She wants to throw a birthday party for Aubrey. Is Aubrey getting close to a birthday already? That's insane. Are they frozen? Yep, mom's frozen. All right, let's have... Um, let's have dad go here real quick. I'm gonna have to reset Georgia. This is a known issue with this game and EA doesn't fix it. Um, all right, so I don't remember. I think it's this book. And this book, I can't remember. All right, I'm gonna have you read this with Eli and read this with Eli, and then I'm just gonna reset mom. Oh, her last name's Car. Oh no. Okay, that's really unfair. So I. Oh man.
All right, we're going to teleport him back over. Wait, where is he? Oh, there he is. Okay. Jack, where are you going? Stop. Read with Eli. Read with Eli. All right. Um, isn't he, okay, yeah, he's in here. So we'll have her put Georgia in the high chair. Yay! So who was this? Oh, this is Eli. Wow, that's a real bad photo. Name it. Um... I don't know what I was naming him. Eli. What's Eli's last name? Broke? Is it a is he a broke? Or is he a newbie? Jack. Hi Pianza Girl. Welcome to the stream. Um, this is his toddler, but I can't remember if he is a newbie or if he is a if he is a what's it called oh no and I only have their first names on here ah uh, that really stinks okay um so Eli finished the xylophone and the peg box. So let me paste these here. And he knows to potty. And his portrait is done. Alright, hopefully his last name Yes, perfect. Okay, it was. It was broke. Alright, we're gonna have you take this. Where have I been putting these? So you have Brittany and Aubrey. Um, I really should only worry about their portraits when they're that age, but I'll give it to him. Okay, mom, I know you're struggling. Um, go ahead and serve her some goopy carbonara. And then let's have you... Yeah, let's just put him to bed. Let's just put um, Frederick in the bed. And how is dad doing? Okay, so they're reading. Give this back to mom. I think I've read all the books with him now. Alright, let's pick up Eli and bring him home. It would be nice if you could someday open a hybrid art gallery and display all these port pictures and maybe in the future some statues. Oh, you know, that would actually be a really cool idea. Oh, we should do that now. Why don't we do that now? You just gave me the best idea ever. I think that's what we're going to do. Maybe we should only do it for the children whom are age up well. Should we only do it for the children who age up well? Like who are, are successful in the challenge? Would that make more sense? Okay, where is Ginger? Is she not eating? Did you not give her food? Um, just give her some baby food. It would make sense to do it just for the ones that age up well. 
Okay. It's four o'clock in the morning, girl. Go to bed. Go ahead and sleep. All right, mom, I'm gonna go ahead and let you get some leftover birthday cake. No, you're not putting him down. You're putting him in the crib. Put Eli in the crib. And then you may go to sleep. So it looks like Aubrey's birthday is coming up. Did you finish it? Eat your birthday cake. And then I'll have you pick her up. Um, Just so you know, I did stream earlier today. I know you weren't there, but I thought I'd let you know. I streamed the rest of the round for the Gavigan household for The Sims 2. Um, um, and so if you wanted to watch that, yeah, I figured it was okay. I was just bored and I just wanted to let you know that if you wanted to check out the rest of that round, you could. Um, so now we're down to the orphanage, which I'm really excited about. <laughs> I may stream again tomorrow during the day at some point if I have time, so. It was, it was a good it was a good bit of a round. It started out a little rough, and then I figured out what the air was that kept coming up. Um, I fixed the air, and then it, like, smoothed out, and it was a smooth sailing ever after that. All right, and then we'll have you go to bed. Good idea about the biographies. Okay, I, I have so many ideas now, like, flying through my head. So, I'm excited. Okay, go to sleep. Please go to sleep. Okay. No, 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 just go to sleep. So many new ideas. I don't know what to do with myself. No! Kid. Oh, she's not tired. Why did I put her in bed? Okay. Go ahead and change her dirty diaper. And then snuggle her. It's at least 6 o'clock in the morning and Georgia hasn't even been to bed yet. This is pretty bad. We need some potions today, I think. Um, Go ahead and... Can't do it while she's crying. Sleep. Okay. Put down Ginger here and then go to sleep. He doesn't have enough to get meditative trance sleep yet. Darn. Okay, I am going to go ahead and let her play on the xylophone. Tomorrow, or today, I mean, is Eli's birthday. And I'm going to make sure he gets everything done. I think the only things we have to do is finish teaching him to walk and to talk. And also, um, I want to make sure that he's read all the books. So if he's read all the books, then I am all set with Eli and I will be as happy as can be. Um... Did Frederick lose his bear? Oh, there it is. He he was playing with it, so he must have left it on the ground. I don't know why, but he did. I was going to say, I know he had a bear, because we give them a bear for every one of their birthdays. So, yeah, Eli ages up today, and we did take him over and read the books with him yesterday, so he should be fantastical. Now we're just waiting on everyone to wake up, but... Um, it's going so slow because she's awake, but she's building skills, so I'm okay with it. It is 8 o'clock in the morning. Holy moly. 
I don't know who's calling you at 8 in the morning, but I'm not answering. I'm busy. I'll make sure they're up by 9. If we have to make, like, invigorating potions or whatever they're called, we'll do so. All right, go ahead and let's get everybody up. It is 9 o'clock in the morning. We need to get up because we have things to do with Eli today. So I'm going to let mom use the bathroom first and go ahead and eat some of the birthday cake. You are going to answer your phone for one. For two, you're going to tons of tips. Earn 500 in tips to improve your relationship with Betty Newbie. Brittany Newbie. Yeah, of course, that's our sister. Go ahead and have a quick meal of some plasma orange juice. And you can go ahead and eat some of the birthday cake. And then you can use and take a shower. I cannot believe that that um, Jack has lived as long as he has with doing the jelly bean challenge. I, I, I'm always like on edge when he does it and then he always makes it. I'm like, wow. Like I'm shocked. All right. Eli is up. So we're going to have mom come on over. She is going to snuggle him. All right, go ahead and clean up your disgusting things. You can clean that, clean that up. And then you can go use the bathroom facilities, of course. Mom's not even hu that hungry. She's just more tired. Does she have an invigorating elixir? No, it doesn't look like it. All right, what about you, Jasmine? Do you have one? Oh, she is potent invigorating. Catherine, we'd love to chat, but we're busy. All right, go ahead and breastfeed him. Okay, and then you can go ahead and put down Eli here. And I am going to have you use one of these potent invigorating elixirs and throw it at your mom. Eli, go to the bathroom. And then we are going to have mom work with him on skills. All right, jo Ginger, mom is gonna change your butt. Change dirty diaper. Okay, so Ginger just finished the xylophone, so I can mark that down. Um, here we go. We'll put that there, there for her, and that is fantastic. Okay, mom, go ahead and. Put down Ginger here. Are you coming? Hold oh, Zibby, Zibwab. <laughs> there we go. All right, and Ginger, I'm gonna have you do this. All right, and you are going to teach him to talk. And we should have done that last night so they could have stayed up all night. Well, the kid had to sleep, didn't he? He's napping. No, stop. 
Okay, so let's see. How high is her writing skill? Oh my goodness. Are we frozen? Oh no, don't crash. No, it crashed. <laughs> oh, man. It's been so long since my game has crashed. All right, let's go back into that if we can get it to launch I'm sure we can that's sims 3 for ya <laughs> I know um no can show you this uh, I saved kind of recently not extremely recently anyway so this is my kids so I have this set up for like A through Z right and then these are our children um, Catherine and Daphne I put them on uh, like number one and two under unsuccessful because I'll keep them I'll, I'll number them like that so that I can see, like, who was unsuccessful and who was successful. These are the unlockable items after e every 10 successful kids. So we'll do the playpen, the walker, the bathing station, uh, the swing, the tree of prosperity, the super sleeper, the gardening station, the multi-tab, the not-so-routine machine, and then the brain enhancing. I don't really... um a little late. <laughs> I don't really know if... um I really want to do some of these because I think they're really cheaty, but it is what it is. Multi-tab is mainly just for homework so that, you know, we could get the kids to do their homework easily. Um, I've got it written down here about all the festival days and then for toddler stages. So this is, I don't know exactly what they failed on. I just wrote fail for all of it because I don't remember. I think I made this like right after I recognized that we failed on them and I was like, I need a spreadsheet cause this isn't working. <laughs> um, so Eli, I'm pretty sure he has done all of the nine books. But we'll probably have to do some of it again. So possibly this and this needs to be done again. Um, wow, way not to pick the same color. Um, so those two will definitely probably have to be done again. I know. Fail. <laughs> um, but I think Eli, definitely a walk and a talk is all he has. And you did see that he was halfway through his talking, so... I'm hoping we can do it. Check on MC for Eli's books. Yeah, I will. Um, and then this is the children's stage. So they just have the oven, the block table, the A, the after school activity, the portrait. There's other things that are not on here, which is really interesting that I haven't put them on here. But there's like an outing with the mom and dad that are supposed to be on here as well. So I'll have to add those in. When we get to someone who's at that stage. And then we have our teen years here. So you have the prom. And then the successfully pranking the school. And then earning an A. An after school activity. I think. Don't the children have to do an after school activity? Uh, five booby traps. Learn to drive. Portrait. Jelly beans. Um, if they get a full scholarship. They only have to do one. If they get a partial. They have to do two. And if they get no scholarship. They have to do three. And then they, I have to get a portrait as a young adult. And then. I'm supposed to delete 10,000 when they move out. So that's interesting. Because that's going to be really difficult. I'm always going to have to have 10,000 on hand when my teens are about to like age up to a young adult. 
Yeah, I could add birthday presents, um, maybe just to remind me what I give each stage. So, like, toddlers, once they hit toddler stage, the birthday present is always a teddy bear. I always give them a teddy bear because I just think that's appropriate for them. But I try to pick the different variations of teddy bears as well, not just, like, the same old generic one because, like, who wants that? Um, but I think for the child stage, I think there's more things here that I'm missing. Um... I'm trying to see what they are. And they're not gonna go away. Am I in the wrong one? No, you're in the wrong one. Um, yeah, so children also have to do an after-school activity. If you have sweet treats, give Ginger the ginger bear. <laughs> um, let's see. So they're supposed to, so toddlers, I guess we could start at toddlers. So toddlers have to be trained to potty, walk, and talk, which I have that first. They have to learn all the skills on the xylophone and peg box, which we have in there. They read all nine books. They have to have a teddy bear in inventory. Um, so I guess I could move this over and then do this like the blue color that's here and do teddy bear. And then... Uh, paste that here, here, and here. Because they all have it when they aged up. And then I will copy this and put those there. And then the portrait is the last thing that they have to have. I wish I had thought about the ginger bear, but I didn't think about it when I was giving her a teddy bear. Um, and then children. So moving on to the children stage. I wonder why I didn't put all of this in here because that's kind of interesting. So the children's stage, they have to learn all the skills on the oven, the block table. They have to do an after school activity. Oh, it is there. Um, they have to have an A in school and a portrait has to be painted. They don't have to do an outing with mom and dad. Is that mega? Is that my mega challenge? Okay, hold on. My game just loaded up. So we can go back in. Um, then teens. So the teens would have to... Oh, and I guess I should put here... Um... What is their, what's the thing that we've been giving children for when they age? Have I been giving them a bed when they age up? Is that what I've been giving them? Uh, 
Anyways, then for my teen years, until I can figure that out, um, I have prom. Okay, let's see what I have on this list, though. They have to do the after-school activity, which is on there. Um, they have to attend... I think that's a, d a dance. I have ants. <laughs> so I'm assuming it meant dance. Children must learn all skills on the baker oven and block table. Sign up for an after school activity. Must get an A in school and must have portrait painted. Okay. Um, okay, so I think that's prom. They must, like, go to prom. Prank the school one time. And it has to be successful. They have to set five booby traps. Um, be taught to drive, have their portrait painted, and then it's talking about when they graduate. What was the thing? I think as a, I think before for this part, this stage, I was giving them something that they were doing. So like if they were, say, into painting, then I was giving them an easel. And if they were into, um, like, writing, then I would give them a computer kind of thing. I don't remember if that's true, though. I also remember in one of my LPs, I was giving everyone a MP3 player. Teens that sign up for an after-school activity must attend at least one dance, must successfully prank the school at least once, must set five booby traps, must be taught to drive, have a portrait. Upon graduation, each child must pass the Grim Reaper's test, eat three beans from the jelly bean tree, um, see the university exam for exemption possibilities. If they survive, they must move out immediately. Okay. And I've gotten all that. One is, like, full is only one jelly bean, blah, blah, blah. And any sim that fails the three jelly bean test ending in their death will not count towards the final 100. Each child that is moved, kicked out from the family, reduces the family funds by 10,000. That is insane. 10000 is so much money. Alright. So I do have all of this going. Where are we at? It is 5 o'clock at night. Is it Eli's birthday? I have a bad feeling this is the day before his birthday. It is. Man. All right, what we're going to do is we're going to have mom stay up all night with Eli and they're going to learn the skills. We're going to use the potion that Jasmine has created, the um potent invigorating to get them through. All right. Because that means I think that Frederick, or not Frederick, that Eli has not read all of his books now. So that's unfortunate. All right, let's get her to come on home real quick. I'm going to have her... Well, you know what? Let's not do it yet. Let's not do it yet. Let's have her go give the presentation. And who is mom taking Imagine care of? Is that Eli? All right, we're going to start working on Eli now. Um, all right, let's go ahead and change his butt. Change his diaper. And then I'm going to have you put down Eli here. And then I'll have you use and take a shower and go to get something to eat. And then I'm going to have Eli go to the bathroom. And then I want to make sure he's done with these. 
Thanks. <laughs> Nina Caliente. Wow. <laughs> Welcome to the stream. <laughs> You're so famous in here. How is Dina doing? <laughs> and Don Lothario. All right, let's get you to feed him and stop watching TV while holding him. You're so weird. Put Frederick in the high chair. Oh, she just gave him a real big stank face when she walked by them. Alright, go ahead and serve him up some Koopy Carbonara. Can't forget about Dandy Dan. Alright, Eli. Okay, he's definitely done with xylophone. Definitely done. And it also looks like he is done with the peg box. Alright, let's get her to also come home. Let's get you to go ahead and eat some birthday cake. Let's go ahead and put Frederick in the crib. And then we are going to go ahead and start with him. But I'm waiting for these dogs. They're so loud running. I'm waiting for her to get home. That's what I was waiting for. I'm going to have her go ahead and throw. Is her mom busy? What's she doing? Okay, she's taking him to bed. Go ahead and have a quick meal of some plasma juice. And then I'm going to have you throw this elixir at your mom. Okay, so he also is going to need to redo the jelly bean test because I do it around 8.30. Shadwell redeemed save. Thanks, Shadwell. I have to refund yours. I was out of game. Save as... It already crashed by that time. Silly head. Good try, though. Yeah. Keeping me on my toes. Even Piazza Girl laughed at you in chat. You did it like right after my game crashed. <laughs> Getting the saves in. Did you remember to grab your soda tonight? Yep, grand. Okay, just tracking. <laughs> oh, by the way, I found this. on the floor in their room. Okay. So it's over here now. All right, we're all saved and ready to go, everyone. Don't anyone worry. All right, we're just waiting on this to all go down. Let's have you go here. All right, everyone keep their fingers crossed for old Jack Broke here that he doesn't, you know. Set the house on fire like that. Okay, that's fantastic. Great. Extinguish those flames. Quick, quick, quick. <laughs> Extinguish! <laughs> oh my god. Please don't burn my whole house down. Please don't burn my whole house down. Come on, Jack. Get it together. All right. 
Alrighty. Well, you can clean this up. All right, I just need to buy one new thing. I have to buy a new uh, jelly bean bush. Oh my God, stop it with this. Ah, where is thy jelly bean bush? Where is it? Holy smokies. Did I miss it? Oh, there it is. I was going to say, I thought it was pretty darn expensive. Alright, when he comes back, we'll have him do this. He made sure to be burn the jelly bean tree. At least saved it quick. <laughs> Alright, why don't you throw that away and come eat two more. Are you fully rested now? No, she hasn't even done it yet. No, stop. You're supposed to be throwing this at your mom. Throw it at your mom. Who's screaming? It's her, isn't it? <sighs> okay. So now that she's got a full burst of energy, she is going to start with um, teaching to talk. And I am going to have her go ahead and snuggle her. Well, he's not lucky enough to get rid of the jelly bean bush. He just gets replaced. All right, two more. That's one. And two. He's stanky as can be. All right, well, he can go to bed. He's all good to go to bed now. Jasmine, I'd really like you to help me out here and just do this. Alright, they're almost done teaching to talk, so that's great. I don't care about the stupid phone right now. Um, Go ahead and put Ginger in the high chair, and we'll give her some food. He is so stanky as can be. <laughs> it's too funny. Alright, did you put her in the high chair? Alright, go ahead and serve her some food. And then you can go ahead and use this. And you can take a shower. Why are you teaching him about getting married? That's weird. He's a toddler. but He doesn't need to know about that. Alright, those two are sleeping. She's taking care of her need. She's going to need a potty, so we'll have to do that. Maybe mom can do it. If mom finishes this with Eli, we can definitely have her do it. Um, I like to... Oh my gosh, where are all the books now? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, they're in her inventory. Why do I always do this? Why do I do this to myself? Alright, so we'll start with green. Um, I can throw out the green books on the ground, and while Mom is doing other things with other kids, he could at least be trying to learn some of them. I don't think he'll get through all three of those before we take him to the library, but I'm going to let him try. Because I want to potty train Ginger. And 
and go from there. All right, Eli is now has learned to talk. So that's fantastic. One more thing down. Go ahead and empty this. Eli, no rest for the wicked here, buddy. You got to read. Mom, come on over here and hold um, Ginger. It actually looks like he knows that book. So I am going to X that out for him. And have you read this. And we'll give this to her. Oh, okay. It looks like he knows that book as well. So we'll have you read this one instead. So maybe he is going to get through all three of the green ones at this rate. Anything? He's done with that one too. Okay, let's put the pink ones out. Let's also potty train her. Let's put the pink ones out. So go ahead and read. I'm going to pass it down to the next child so I can remember which ones I've read with who, you know? Okay, so it looks like pink is where he's kind of at, which is fantastic. So we'll let him start reading. You redeemed another save. We'll save as. We'll do one. There we go. Saving. Okay, perfect. So once mom is done getting her potty trained, what else does she need? Oh, she needs a diaper change now. She like didn't make it in time. Okay, so mom should have all of the books, I do believe. All of the books left that he needs to know. Alright, change her dirty diaper. And then I'm going to let mom go to the bathroom. Alright, put down Ginger here. Come on in here, use this. another TV on somewhere right there okay no time for that play with the xylophone Eli he really needs to go potty he needs to go to bed I really want to get something something else done with him okay so I'm thinking we're gonna have mom come over and teach him to walk And I am going to tell him to stop reading. And I'm going to give this book back to mom. And I'll do it as the first book so that I know that's the one he was reading. So it shouldn't go, it shouldn't take too long. All right, come teach him to walk. And Ginger is doing well there. And he is already potty trained. And he's already halfway through learning to talk or walk. So this is going to be really easy. The only other thing after this that I think we have is we've already got his portrait. Um, so the only other thing we have is to um, just have him l read the books. 
And I will have Jasmine finish the portrait again because it's now not finished again. So I will have her finish it, but it is started. So even if it doesn't get finished before he ages up, it's still, he's still properly aged. All right, we're going to go ahead and let you use the potty. No, you're not putting him in the crib. You're putting him down. He's going to go use the potty. Stop. I don't want you to do that. Go here. Is it working? Oh. Stop it. Alright, I will let Eli get a little bit of rest and we will feed him. Can she stop it? Go here. And I'll also get um, Frederick up and get him fed as well. I wonder why we went Eli, Frederick. Oh, never mind. Frederick was born before Ginger. I was thinking Ginger was born before Frederick, but that wouldn't make sense. All right, let's go ahead and put Eli in the high chair. I know he's tired, but he does need to eat. And this is Frederick's bear. I don't know why it's on the ground, but it is. See, it's his. Everyone else has theirs. She's got the fairy bear. That's too funny. Should have done the ginger one like you said. That would have been funny. Alright. Go ahead and um, just give him baby food. Is there breakfast in here? No. Maybe we'll serve up some breakfast. Maybe we'll make up some pancakes. <clears throat> I can't wait until one of our spouses does the culinary career just so we can get the fridge. Alright, when Jasmine wakes up, I'm going to let her clean this. I'm going to let her have a quick meal of some plasma orange juice. And then I want her to go ahead and continue the portrait just so we can get it done with. We have 51,078. Um, so we can either buy the lot for the museum or we can create more, um, for the house. She could get the culinary career. Yeah, she could. Um, actually, I don't know if she can, but I think that any spouse could. All right, go ahead and play with that. She just got a wish to get a tattoo. <laughs> All right, we're going to put Eli in his crib. What are you doing? Stop it. Go ahead and eat the birthday cake. Then use this. Take a shower. Ew. Why are my Sims making such disgusting pancakes lately? Spring onion pancakes. There was another one. What was the other one? I can't even remember, but she just made broccoli pancakes. What is wrong with my Sims? <laughs> I'm literally dying. Broccoli pancakes. Was it spinach? Oh my gosh. That is too much. All right, we'll kick it up a notch and we'll grab a plate. He wants to see a wild horse or teach Ginger to talk. I would rather you teach Ginger to talk. This man is stankin', okay? Really, seriously, stankin'. All right, clean this. What's up with her? Why, why are my Sims doing such 
crazy things. It's like, they don't know what the custom foods they should use and shouldn't use. It's funny. All right. How is Ginger doing on... Okay, she's not... Moved on to the peg box. Oh, no. He's crying now. All right. You know what? When Dad's done in the shower, he can come pick up Frederick. And we'll get Frederick um, taken care of. There's a dish served in the Chinese takeout called scallion pancakes, but it's more like a bread than a pancake. I mean, I could understand that, but broccoli pancakes? I don't think so. They put syrup on those and butter. Gross. That is so gross to think about. Broccoli with syrup on it. Yuck. All right, we're going to have you go ahead. Oh, because you haven't picked him up yet. Man. All right, when she's done with her portrait, let's go ahead and have her clean this up. Because I don't want to have to keep cleaning up after her. Nothing in the rules against Jasmine getting a job. Oh, really? Okay. So we could have her do it then. All right, we're going to put these away. Then we're going to clean that. Put Frederick in the high chair. He's getting some good sleep. She's busy. Okay, perfect. And then we'll have you clean this up. I mean, she liked it. She was like, mm hmm like, like, it was good, so. To each their own, I guess, huh? Where are you, Jack? There you are. I was getting a bit concerned there, buddy. All right, go ahead and serve him up some of the broccoli pancakes. Sounds so disgusting. All righty, come on in here and is it seriously not dirty? Doesn't that look dirty? Why does it look like that? Use and take a shower. I didn't know this for the founder. What do you mean? Okay, he does want a garden. So I am going to go ahead and let him tend to the garden. While Frederick eats. Alright, so she got her first point in the pegs box, which is fantastic. Eli's not quite done sleeping yet, so I think I'm going to let mom come get her. Uh, never mind, I read it wrong, but this does say that Jasmine can get a job. Okay. Hold on, I'm going to read in just a second. Alright, mom, come over here and change his dirty diaper. Then go ahead and... Attack him with the claw. Toss him in the air. Tickle him. A career is optional and can be a rabbit hole or profession. You must change careers each time your sim ages back down to young den. Casino items are off limits for everyone except the founder on the following days only. First day in town until 10. Oh, excuse me. Oh. 10 p.m. and every birthday after. You didn't know about the g being able to go and gamble is what you mean? Okay, we're going to have you come over here and play with the xylophone. Eli, I really wish you would wake up, dude. Um... I think if he's not awake by like 1230, I am going to force him to wake up. Because I really want to get that done. He wants to buy a Bonilda coffin. Nah. 
I knew that it was the profession or career. Oh. Oh, yeah. I knew I could get a job. I just prefer not to because I have so much on my hands as it is with raising the kids that I just don't think there's time for that. Yeah, me either. <laughs> we pretty much just said the same thing. It's too funny. I'm really just waiting on Eli to wake up. And she's going to come in here and make a clay sculpture. Alright, that's fine. And it looks like she's getting close to finishing that painting then. And this is of Eli as a toddler. I love how she can do this in the room while the baby is sleeping. Like, no care in the world. All right, he wants to complete three wall murals. He also wants to get married, but that's probably never going to happen. Um, so, yeah. He got his fishing skill up. Um, the dog just ran through my house. All right, let's let him do some wall murals, I guess, while he's doing nothing with his life. So, let's see. Tag a wall. Here, come tag this wall. And then, you know what? Just do all three right in a row. One, two, and three. There you go. All right. He's busy. She's busy. Let's check and make sure we've paid our bills. We'll have her get the mail. I don't know what's in it, but we'll have her get it. And then I'm going to let her take care of the rest of her needs. Looks like this is dead, so we're going to dispose of it because it's dead. And we don't need dead things in our home. <laughs> Alright, how is Eli doing? I have let him oversleep. Alright, let's wake you up. Let's get you to stop. Let's get you to hold him. We're going to go over to the library and we are going to read books. It's the first thing on my agenda. And then when we're done, we will teach him to walk. Um, actually, let's just do this. Let's have him learn to walk first. There we go. I hope I have enough time. I don't want a third person, like a third baby in a row that isn't successful. So I'm really hoping we're going to get there. Alright, when Jasmine is done, I'm going to have her take care of Ginger. She can come over and she can change her dirty diaper. Today is his birthday. It is 2.15 in the afternoon. But as long as he keeps walking every single time, this will go in like no time. It's when he sits down that it becomes a problem. Okay. Okay, she's coming over for Ginger. He's almost done. Alright, we are going to put her in the high chair. Let's go ahead and put Ginger in the high chair.
Why don't you go to the bathroom? You didn't finish all your wall murals, but you're inside. Why? Oh, we did. Did I not do the right thing? I'm confused. Alright. Go ahead and serve her the broccoli pancakes. Prove your athletic skill by one level and return to the stadium. Sure. Alright, we're, we're gonna finish. Here we go. And then we're going over to the, li to the library and we're reading the books instantly. It's the only other things he has to have done. There we go. Alright, so go ahead and pick him up. A broccoli omelet. Right. Alright, let's go ahead and have you come on over here to the library. I think he only has four books to read. Never mind, he has six. I thought it was only four. I really hope we can do this. I'm getting really nervous. My heart is starting to race. <laughs> I hate it. All right, maybe Jack can go ahead and put her in the crib when she's done. All right. Pick her up. And we will put her in the crib. And we're going to go with mom. Oh, I'm nervous. It's five o'clock. Read with Eli, 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 and read with Eli. Put the stupid creepy doll away <laughs> so we can read with you. Yes. Go in, Daza. Grosama. Maga weepers. Kawa. Burla. Tubi gal. A gala suplora. Please, buddies. Gee, Johnny's the fighting. Bunny or red. That's a me bad. Sagoob. Badu G. Mazinibado. Zip nice. We might make it. I really wish they could just sit there and pull out the next book, you know what I mean? It'd be so much better. Oh my goodness. Lord have mercy, girl. <laughs> it's the library. <laughs> oh no, what's wrong? 
I don't think they finished that last book. Did we get a pop up that he did this? <laughs> not sure. Okay. Well, he did the last one, so I'm not sure he would have stopped doing the one before. Okay, I think we're done. Um, Enros, Master Controller. What's it under? Basic. Is that what it's under? Mm. Or is it advanced? Is it s books? Toddler books. Yes, we know them all. Okay, we just got to get home and get him to birthday cake like instantly. I really hope they can make it home because we don't live very close to the library. Um, but here's what we're going to do. We're going to get all the stuff. We're going to get everything ready for the party. It's the second they walk through the door, we're doing the party. Um, entertainment. Looking for a birthday cake. I would make one, but I don't have time. Um, and I'm going to swap out these balloons. We'll do the white and black ones this time because we did have the other color for the last birthday. So I've got the birthday balloons and then his, um, birthday gift is supposed to be something. The rules say you need the cake out even if it isn't used. Um, I don't really know what to give this kid, so having something in your paw, a bike. Okay, we could do a bike. One of these. Do we have a bike rack? Oh my god, that deer. <laughs> Do we have a bike rack? Alright, we'll buy a bike rack then. We could put it like right here in the front. And put the bike on it. And then mom can give it to him. Uh, we'll put this in inventory. Really? Why? Alright. All right, so we've got everything out. We've got the balloons. We've got the birthday cake. We've got all, everything taught and learned. Um, so we just got to make it home, and then we'll blow all the candles for him. And they're already on their way home. So I'm pretty excited. It is a perfect gift. I never think of it. I don't know why. Oh, well, he didn't make it home. Does it count? Does it still count? Uh, I don't know if it still counts. <laughs> we didn't even make it home. Oh no. He's growing up in the snow. <laughs> Cross-eyed as can be. It still counts if you know if I have everything out? Oh, perfect. Okay, great. Um, okay, so due to our excellent parenting skills, we can choose a trait for him, but we really can't. Oh, well, thank you, because I would have thought he would didn't, wasn't successful because he didn't use the cake. 
Uh, because even because we were not even on the lot, so that's another reason. But all right, so he's friendly, virtuoso, and a loser. <laughs> I'm gonna cry. <laughs> I'm going to cry. Okay. So we'll have to get him a makeover. But the first thing he needs to do is go to the bathroom. I literally had just enough time to get all that done. Alright. So, so far, Eli is successful then. So we'll keep advancing with him. Georgia, you're going to go home. You want to potty train Frederick, which is fine. I also want you to go to the bathroom. So let's get you to go to the bathroom too. There is so many people at this library right now. It's insane. <laughs> Birthday parties must occur for each child with cake, balloons, and a gift. The cake does not have to be used, but must be purchased. You can wait for the system to age them up. Oh, good. Great. At least I knew, I, at least we know now that I did it. Why is he crying? I can only imagine. I can only imagine. All right, let's have them head on home anyways. Seems like kind of a waste to purchase a cake and not use it, but it's all good. And this is his picture right here. So, perfect. Let's go here with Eli. And I am going to save. Save as... <sighs> yes, saving, saving, saving. That's like a sigh of relief because I was literally thinking it was going to go really, really bad and we weren't going to finish his his um, stuff. So hopefully everything is going to be okay. You redeemed that when he finish the books yeah I just was trying to get them home for the birthday because I was trying to be quick and I didn't want, I didn't want to take a second to save I know I should have but I didn't want to at the moment but I'm using it now all right all saved everything's good they're on their way home we're gonna go ahead and name this we're gonna name it Eli Eli broke and I'm going to put in parentheses toddler. Okay. I'm going to put that in Eli's pocket just for right now. I know me neither. All right. She is asleep and he is doing nothing great for us. So that's fantastic. Go ahead and play with this. She's drinking. Blow out candles. I don't think so. Um, sure. It is 940 and he needs to do the jelly bean challenge again. So we're going to have him come out here and get to it. He wants to learn painting and take a class in painting. Um, that's fine. He can do so. Next toddler up. Yeah, next one's Ginger. We also got to work on some of Eli's things, but he does have a little bit longer. He has seven days now. So we're getting there. <gasps> Jack, please do not die. Please do not die. Please do not die. Please, 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 please. Please don't die. E birthday cake. You can eat some birthday cake and then take a shower. Where are you going? You need to... Why can't he do this? Is it because he's singed that he can't do it? Alright, we'll go have him shower then. And then I'm going to have mom go ahead and put Frederick in the crib. Where are you going? Eat some Sue surprise. 
All right, let's see. Till this mood light goes away. There we go. Two more, buddy. And you just broke this, and so now you got to repair it. Yeah, as it happens. Eli needs a good makeover. <laughs> Poor kid. All right, we're going to turn this off. I'm going to let him sleep in this bed. I don't know why, but I am. He's stinky again. Lord have mercy, man. <laughs> Alright, Jack. Uh, uh, oh my god, the freaking shower's broke. Oh. <laughs> the shower's broke! The shower's broke! Oh my god, oh my god, can you extinguish him? <laughs> the shower's broke! Um... baby down and come extinguish him now oh my god we can't get to him we can't get to him <laughs> Go here. can he move put out sim put out sim hurry where are you going oh my god oh no come on run don't walk run Oh my gosh. Oh my god. If she walked any slower, he's going to die. Put the man out. <laughs> she had no rush to that walk. Yes, the gate is locked. I just had a mini heart attack. Stop, drop, and roll, Jack. <laughs> oh my gosh. He, he literally was 30 seconds away from dying. Because Georgia just walked so slow. She's like, yeah, I'm going to go put this man out. <laughs> she, had no, she had no reason to walk so slow, but she did. Oh my gosh, she just almost killed her hu her man. Like, what is wrong with you? What is wrong with you? Oh my gosh, she had to walk all the way into the dining room, put the baby in the high chair. <laughs> she just didn't even care. Oh man. Okay, come in here. Serve up some pancakes to him. Oh... That was like a heart attack and a half. Okay, stop it with this. Go to bed. All right, go here. Can you please repair the shower? Sleep. Oh my gosh, you guys in your saves. All right, let's save as three. Oh, well, my husband's on fire. I will just mosey on over. <laughs> Honestly, if she had went any farther into the dining room to put the baby down, she probably wouldn't have made it. She was just... She was going so slow. And also, I did realize that, I, and I, I, I do, I didn't know this, but I forgot it, that when she starts the interaction of, like, extinguishing him when he's on fire, the mood lit pauses. Because if it didn't pause, he probably would have been a goner. <laughs> it probably would have taken him. There would have been nothing I could have done. Oh my gosh. That is insane. She's just like, yeah, another one's going. <laughs> she just moses on over. <laughs> oh my gosh. One of our friendly ghosts are back. What's wrong? 
The TV's on? No. This TV's on? No. Go to sleep. Why are you waking up screaming? There we go. Okay, he's sleeping. I know, we really do. How many kids do we have with him? Three so far? Oh, okay. Well, we only have one with Hal, but I guess that's technically the one like you start with, right? Because Hal is like the one that... Wait, who's her dad? Oh, no, that's Trevor Carr. Okay. Yeah, so Hal was our first husband, and he died pretty quickly, I think. Honestly. I really do think so. And then we had the newbie, and we got the three the three girls. And now we have the three brokes. So. George is saying, why are my husbands dying? Is it something I am doing? Of course it is, because you're moseying on over while your husband's on fire. All right, let's go ahead and put Frederick in the crib. <clears throat> oh my goodness, that is not... Oh my goodness, Hal just scared the bejesus out of me. All right, clean that up. And then put Frederick in the crib. Why is Eli so upset? Go to bed. Go here. No. Just go to bed. You've had a very rough night. Oh, George is awake. Alright. Let George out. And go to bed. I didn't even realize we had that high chair over there. I feel like all we need are quads. I don't think we need anything more. Like quad high chairs. Alright, let Ginger out and then go to sleep. Can the Hal get out of my way? I am a busy woman and I don't have time for that. Nah, that's alright. He's just talking to Hal. He's asking for a bedtime story. He wants to become friends with someone. Jeez. Well, I don't think Hal is it. I'm going to be honest with you. Alright, if you let her out, then you can go to bed and I'll have mom take care of her. Because mom doesn't need to sleep tonight. She is fantastic today. So she can take care of the babies. Go ahead and pick up Ginger. And we'll get her fed. Can this kid please go to bed? Put Ginger in the high chair. She wants to get a tree house. That's really sweet. We could grow something else there. Maybe we should grow some life fruit or something. Or not life fruit. That's not what I meant. Um, plasma fruit. Alright, clean this up. I'm going to have a quick meal of some plasma juice. You go ahead and serve her up some pancakes. Some of those pancakes. Alright, and then you can use... And shower. How long do the twins have? Three days. 
We really gotta buckle down with them today. Applesauce. All right, is there anything we can have you clean or something while we wait? Hmm, doesn't look like it. You don't need to sleep, you're fine. She does want to learn a new recipe. All right, does she need to potty? She does. I love that she's wearing cowboy boots. I really like that. All right, pick the pick up Ginger. And, oh my gosh, how? Bring her over here. Potty train her. We'll get one more thing worked on. Okay. So we'll get her potty trained. And then I think we'll teach her one of her other skills. Or maybe we'll let her work on the peg box while she goes and tries to learn the stink juice potion. So let's have you work on this. I'll let you empty this. Because we do got to finish that peg box. And we'll let mom go ahead and take care of her needs. And then we'll let her try and make a stink juice potion. Oh, wait. We can make it. So she can just make it. We don't have to, like, worry about it. Are you mastered in painting? Yeah, you are. Have you finished all the skill challenges? Yes. Okay, so we don't need to be working on anything painting related. I'm going to have you start working on some writing. Come on. Scrap that. And where is the computer? Oh, it's over here. All right, we're going to have you start writing a trashy novel. I want to get her high enough where she can write the biographies. <clears throat> and then I want mom to work a little bit more on her lifetime wish. Um, and get her to the point where she can do the ice sculptures that never melt. And then we can go from there. So hopefully we can get that done. And that will give each one of them something to do for all of the kiddos that are successful. And if I have to, what I'll do is I can, I can pull Aubrey back in from my bin. And... Um, I can have them do like the young adult statue and everything of her. But if we do it quick enough, she might still be young enough where we could just do it right away. And we wouldn't have to worry about it. Alright, so she's going to make the distinct juice potion. Everybody is working on something that needs to be worked on. I also think there is a sleeping potion that we should be making. Um, it makes it where... Oh, he shouldn't go back to bed. <clears throat> it makes it where we sleep, like, really, really quickly. And I feel like we should do some of those sometimes. Eat some of the pancakes. So that he... So that we could sleep really quickly and we wouldn't have to sleep so long. And then we could just get right back into whatever we were working on. Man, he didn't get to do barely anything. <clears throat> you use those? 
Yeah, I feel like I should use them too. Especially for this challenge. Because I really need the extra time. Um, Alright, how close is Frederick to getting up? Mm, he's not that close. Once she makes this, I think I'm going to have her serve up some more breakfast. Have her serve up some waffles. Okay. Alright, she is done with the peg box. Let's have you pay the bills and get the mail. All right, what else does Ginger need to work on? <clears throat> um, let's have her start reading the book then. If she's done with everything she can teach to herself, then we'll have her start working on some of these books while mom is working on some other stuff. And then at least we're still keeping her going. I don't want her to read all of them like this because it is much more time consuming. But this way she's still working on something while we need to be working on something as well. So I really do like that. Take out the trash, clean the dishes. We could take out the trash. All right, I'm gonna have him get on up and I'm gonna use and take a shower. Um, is she hungry? No, but she doesn't need social. I'm gonna have mom teach her to some skills in a little bit, but for right now, let's just have Jack do this and then maybe we can try and do these wall murals i guess i did the wrong thing i didn't know there was a difference honestly oh right here tag wall or wall mural okay 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 oh my gosh these are much bigger all right so we need to do three of these one two and three. There we go. Perfect. All right. She just needs social really bad. She's okay. So we'll get mom fed and then we'll go from there. And Frederick, he's getting close to waking up. He'll need to go potty. So mom has it cut out for her. She wants to hire a butler. She's like, I can't handle this anymore. <laughs> I love how she just makes plain old waffles, though. All right, so we'll have her kick it up a notch, and then we'll have her put it away. And then I'll have her come on over here to... Maybe she could get Frederick up first. Get him potty trained, and then she can work on Ginger. So we will have you hold him. What is going on with this? Why is there stew surprise on the table? <clears throat> Can he eat the stew surprise? No. Have you clean this up? I'll have you clean this up because I don't know where it came from. And then I'll have you eat some of the birthday cake. Stinky bugs. Yeah, you can clean the bug cage after school. That's fine. Mom is feeling good. Her energy's low. It's noon. And it's a little bit lower than half, but she'll be all right. She'll make it through the rest of the day. And then she can have a good night's rest tonight. But I got to get her going on some of this stuff with these twins. Because when there's twins, there's double the amount to do. And that's the issue. That's what happened with Catherine and Daphne. We didn't adjust. I didn't adjust for the fact that there was double the amount to do. And it kind of screwed me over in the long run. So I'm not going to do that this time. <clears throat> I'm going to be smart about it. Oh, 
Candy Doop. Them to be. Waiting vloggy, Doop Doop. All right. So he is going potty, and then we'll feed him. Oh, he's so close. Oh, did he? Oh, he got it. Yes. All right, we want to see him age up well. All right, we're going to go feed him. And then we'll come back and take care of Ginger. We'll probably potty train her, which will give her some social, which will be good. This house is so big. <laughs> Takes him forever to get across it. Alright, let's serve him up some of the broccoli pancakes. And then I will let her use the bathroom. And then I'm going to have her come over here and potty train Ginger. How's Jasmine doing? She's just loving it in here. Jasmine is so pretty. Stunning. Absolutely stunning. Why does he have all this personal time off? What's going on there? Alright, little man. Alright, once he's done, you can go ahead and let him out. Because he's coming in here anyways. He just finished that. He wants to buy a seesaw, serve a home-cooked meal at a party, and we'll go for buy a seesaw, I guess. All right, let's go potty train Ginger. Oh, we'll say we'll go. I don't know if we'll actually go, but we'll say we're going to go. Hopefully we'll go. All right, I think this is one of the books from her inventory. So I'll put it as the first one because it's the one she's working on. And we'll go from there. Alright, and then I'm going to have mom go put her in the high chair. When she's done pottying, of course. Okay, there we go. Nice. They both just got potty trains. One less thing I have to worry about. All right. When Frederick gets out. Oh, he's already out. He can come on over and play. Um, it's 3.30 in the afternoon. Who could we have him chat with on the phone? A coworker, maybe? Maybe that would work. All right, we are going to give him some food, give her some food. Serve her up some of the pancakes as well. All right, he needs a shower really bad. And his favorite color is brown. And I will give him a makeover here. Not, probably not on this stream. Um, but I'll give him a makeover for sure. Also thinking I might do the makeover and a build video for this. Like an actual recorded video. I might do those separately so that they're not in the streams. And we can just focus on the gameplay in the streams. Because I think that'll be all good. <coughs> All right, she's working on this. She's getting kind of thirsty. So when she's ready, she can come over and have some plasma juice. 
What else does she need? She needs her hygiene taken care of. All right, I will let her take out the trash because she does want to do so. Oh my goodness. Seriously, clean that up. Sure, we can chat for a little while. No. Why doesn't he just take a nap and then go clean the bug cage? Stop it. Go ahead and pick her up. You can change your diaper. Go ahead and snuggle her. And put Ginger in the crib. And I've been having this kid work on this all day and he's done with the xylophone. So that's fantastic. All right, go ahead and use this. Nice. She's got her writing up to four. She's doing really well. All right, if he wants to buy a seesaw, we will buy a seesaw. That's no big deal. Um, let's just buy it. Get it out of the way. Where is thy seesaw? Here it is. I'll just put it out here. Let's see. There. And now he wants to see his daughter age up well and his son. So that's really good. Okay, so now he's officially working on something he actually needs to work on. Um, Ginger seems to be a little bit ahead of him because she's finished xylophone and peg box. They both know to potty. I think they both still need to be taught to walk and talk. Um, let me just check. If I can click on him. Um, yeah, talk and walk for him. And then I'm pretty sure she probably also needs that. And then on top of that, um, we got to do the books with them. But otherwise, we're doing really well. Alright, mom. Receive a text from Daphne. She's coming in to clean up. I thought she was eating. Oh, she's eating now. Okay, it's 7 o'clock. Let's go ahead and let him do his magic jelly bean test. Welcome back. When kiddo gets done cleaning the bug cage, um, he can come home and he can go to sleep. Because he's exhausted. Dad is going stir crazy from not leaving. Maybe you should go to work. Mm. That'd be fantastic. And today is going to be snowflake day, so he's not going to go to work again. Mm -hmm. oh. mm. hey. Alright, but I will let him come on over here and play with Frederick. Is she actually at the party? What is she doing? Building an igloo? No. This is where they live? Oh my goodness gracious. Um, 
why don't you come in here and give her a hug. How do they all live here with a two bed? Okay. I'm not going to ask. I'm not going to ask questions. Um, we'll be friendly and we'll come give all of our kiddos hugs. Aww, the really sad music is playing. Oh. It's the sad music. Okay, so mom is getting friendly with everyone. Yeah, she's pretty much like, I came to like just see you guys and I gotta go. <gasps> I'm exhausted. <laughs> Poor girl. Alright, so he finished cleaning the bug muck off of the bug cage at school. So he is on his way home now, which is fantastic. We need, before you go all the way home, hold on Georgia, before you go all the way home, let's get him signed up for his after school activity. Um, so that we know we have it for the next time we play this. Where is the school? I always forget where the school is in this town. I can never find it. It's like not in the place where I think it should be. Yeah, it's like over here. Um, sign up for after school activity. What are his traits? I forget. Sorry, I gotta go look. Virtuoso. So maybe music class. Is there a music class? Scouting, study, art. All right, we'll do scouting for Eli and then you can go home okay I promise so tomorrow will be the festival day so Jack gets a break from the jelly bean test which is fantastic and we'll be going to the festival tomorrow oh man that kind of cuts into my days with Ginger and Frederick but maybe we could do some stuff at the festival if we think smart and hard about how to get it done without freezing to death hopefully we can get it done we do need to get a portrait taken um not that we're keeping the portraits because we're not but just to say that we you know went it's like our souvenir as a teen he could do music club right i forgot that it was only teens i really wish the children could do it because like come on a child likes music okay whether they're five or 55 you know people like music so they should be able to do music whenever they want to do music but it is what it is. All right, Georgia. Once you're done here, you're going to go home and you're going to go to bed. Um, he is in bed. Or at least he should be in bed. Yes, it's going up. I'm going to jump over to Jasmine. She's actually headed to bed as well, so she's being smart. So that's fantastic. I love when my sims are very smart. Um, what else do we have here? Frederick... He's good. He just really needs to go potty. So once he's ready, he can go. Um, I'm just going to get everyone pretty much to bed. And then we'll go ahead and go from there. Um, let's see. You. He is now in his after school activity, which is fantastic. I'm very happy about that. And my timer is coming up to save, which is perfect because I'm about to get off. So I'm going to go ahead and save. And that'll be it. Night, Shadwell. All right, you have a good time with your modeling, model truck, I mean, not modeling, and um, I hope to see you soon. Do, 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 do. Good night to you, sir. Alrighty, 
I am going to go ahead and leave it there. I think that's a good spot. I know that everyone's not in bed and I normally like it to be where everyone's in bed, but we just saved and the only thing they're going to do is come home and go to bed. So we'll just start there and we'll start with festival day. And the next time we play this, um, I will be live again tomorrow. So definitely check that out. I will let you know possibly on my discord if I'm going to go live in the afternoon. Um, it really depends on what's going on in my real life <laughs> at the time and how I'm feeling. So if, uh, you know, I'm having a bad day, I'm probably not going to go live, but that's just that. So I will be back definitely tomorrow night though for Shersies. Um, we're prob possibly going to do something else in the Sims 3. Uh, so, oh yeah, we'll do something else in the Sims 3. So probably maybe mega challenge or hybrid baby or whatever. So we'll see what we get into and um, look forward to a build video and a cast video for Eli that'll be coming out probably just as a video instead of a stream because I think it'll be just easier and I'll be able to do it on my own free time and I will talk to you guys tomorrow. Have a great beginning of your Saturday. Later.